Hello guys, this is me again from Jotech Point. Today I will show you an Android emulator. Uh, I just got this after using uh, ND, Bluestacks, uh, Windroid, Droid and uh, Genie Motion also. Uh, it it very easy to install and it's uh, very handy to use. I'll just show you in this video and I will review in this video. Okay guys, so let's just start it. So here it's my Nox uh, Android app player setups. Uh, it's just only 251 uh, megabytes. Uh, you can see here it's just 251 megabytes. So you can download it. I will give you a link uh, below. Just click on. It's required no virtual box, nothing, and no VMware, virtual machineware, nothing is just installed, and it's uh, very handy to use. Let's see, Let's start now. It's starting, installation is completed. Now, it's starting the emulator. There are also a lot of features in it. Let me show you. See, this is uh, Nox uh, Nox app player Android emulator. It runs on Android KitKat. the navigation skis here you can go back uh, you can check all the details kernel version and everything first you need to add account if you have google account so you can add your google account here Google account so you can add it. You have Google account now add it. Go to Play Store. See you can see here uh, Play Store. and this is a simulator I will show you later uh, this is you can take screen capture also see this is screen capture and this is a this is for virtual location you can add your own location and other location this is my computer most important uh, thing in it uh, you can get to root already please turn root on the system first so you can uh, you can make it a uh, rootable. You can change your performance setting middle high. You can change whatever you want and start up setting as a phone, customize tablet. Uh, in properties, uh, there you can see your uh, IMEI or number also here. In shortcuts, you can take whatever you want. And this is all save changes. Uh, I don't want to change any settings. Okay, and this is for your full screen so you can see your full screen if you want to uh, back to your normal screen so just escape and this for sound you can increase your sound it works like uh, fully your android phone in your hand or your android tablet in your screen and this is for apk you can add apk directly here and you can drag and drop 
This is for reboot. It, this is the, its performance with certain uh, windows. And this is for uh, you can also macro record. You can also recording. Stop it. Uh, this also for your. video you can play it you can play see you can see video is uh, running you can directly record this screen and you can do your stuff uh, this is for multiplayer you can add another tablet on your screen just uh, add emulator and if not it's unlocking first it's Nox, which is this uh, window is running and it's adding another Nox one uh, will add another multiple windows will open if you want to start delete and backup this so you can use multiple tablets uh, I will just delete because I don't want to use it ok and this for uh, manage common function like uh, you can go directly in your settings this is for navigation keys ok uh, back and this uh, home button and this for menu this is very interesting. I'll show you how to install APKs. Just go to APKs. See, you can drag and drop here. APK. Don't show me. I know. It will open this APK and go to your APK folders. Android apps. They are our install like stick cricket. It's my favorite game. So, start to install. how to map keys uh, in this game uh, using uh, if, if you want to play game uh, using your keyboard so how to map keys uh, in this tablet so it's very simple just go to this uh, icon here simulate and ok so just touch here right see I already mapped this so just click just click and press your keyboard right arrow and go here click on it and just uh, uh, tap your uh, left arrow key ok and save here save it ok now continue and you can play see it's working you can uh, map any game you can map for any game you want to it's very easy so uh, it's very this for it uh, and this uh, runs very smoothly other than any android emulator you see candy blue stacks draw and genie uh, motion so they they hang your computer they slow down your process of your computer so this is not in happen in Nox, uh, Nox Android app player it's run very smoothly and very fast uh, this is how uh, it's already comes with file manager you can manage your file directly and you can just skip back on browsers and your facebook lite and everything is perfectly and you can uh, add uh, wait. How to uh, do this Android emulator using simple steps? Just go to just go to your general uh, here below the below the run on startup. There's a root the root option is off. So just on it. Setting on. Save changes. Restart now. Restart. import your files uh, from your computer and from your tablet so if you want to open image folder this is open 
open with your uh, email folder uh, I mean your file explorer uh, email folder okay because you can go file so you want to take uh, your file from uh, your file manager to your computer if you want to export file so just open local shared folder if you want to uh, move your uh, file from your computer to uh, email data so you can export and you can use here in your uh, share folder c user your username document doc share you can here add you see i just add one uh, application you can add images and other things so it's very easy now you can access anything from here so this is it guys hope you like it